Hello, hello, it's Elizabeth Busby here, and welcome to Discerning Marriage. If you can say yes to this question, then the person you're with could be the one. <laughs> Before we get into it, make sure that you like this video, you subscribe to our channel, and you click the notification bell so that you can always be notified when we drop a new Discerning Marriage episode. I bet you are dying to know what the question is. The question is, do you want other people running around this world who are just like the person that you're dating? Is that a trick question? Do you wanna be responsible for there being more tiny humans like your partner? If you can say yes to that question, that is a good sign that you guys are on the right path. If this gives you some hesitation, <laughs> That is a great opportunity for you to take a step back and think about, okay, what elements of this person do I not want to procreate in the world? What elements of this person are giving me pause? How do I want to approach that? Do I want to talk to them about these qualifications, qualifications, these qualities in their life? Or am I just ready to end the relationship? <laughs> I don't know. But it's a really good litmus test for how you feel about this person and how you feel about marrying this person because babies come from marriage. So when you're in a relationship with someone, this can be a good litmus test to think about, would I want to be responsible for there being more people like this running around the world? Yes or no. If you want to go deeper into more intriguing questions like this, we wrote a course for you to deep dive into this sort of thing. It is called Next Step, and it is based very heavily on John Paul II's proximate preparation for marriage, the topics that he said were important to discuss before you are engaged. So I would love to accompany you deeper into your own marriage discernment, deep diving into questions like this and other topics that will help you to make a healthy and holy marriage, or that will give you the courage to walk away if this this person is not someone whose qualities you want to be responsible for in the generations to come. So click the link in the description if you want to learn more about Next Step. Lots of information there for you that you can deep dive into to help you figure out if the course is for you, which will help you figure out if the person is for you. So thank you so much for being here. It is always an honor when you spend time with me, and I love, love, love getting to connect with you like this. Until next time, stay close to the heart of Jesus and be not afraid. Bye. Bye.